Hello everybody, praise be to God, and welcome to what is probably going to be the last episode of The Secret of Monkey Island. So, now that we've got the head of the navigator, we should be able to get through this, um, cavern of lava. And death. So we're gonna just walk on through. Once we get to the actual maze part, we're gonna pull out the navigator's head. And hopefully that'll help us on the way. Yeah, yeah. Alright. Yep, here he is. I think it wants me to go to the left. Okay. I think it wants me to go to the left. Okay. Now it wants me I to I think go it wants right. me to go to the right. Okay. I mean, the head is really weird. Really weird. Very creepy as well, but alright. So now he's facing to the left. Yep, so he wants me to go back to the left. And as you can see, it's just changing like crazy. This is ridiculous. Okay. So we're going up here. Now we're going back. way. Alright. I wanted to make sure you didn't want me to go back up through that cavern. Okay, let's go through here. I have no idea how this head knows how to get through, but I'm not going to argue with it. Sesame Street. Okay. Yeah, good luck getting through here without the navigator's head. Here we go! The ghost ship! The ghost ship does look pretty awesome. music. Uh... <laughs> you wouldn't happen to have a root I could borrow. Yikes! <laughs> I love this music they're playing. It's so good. Anything related... Anything Celtic sounding I'm probably gonna like. Looks like that's not gonna work. Hey, there's. The, he's wearing the necklace that makes him invisible to ghosts, so let's try using that. Ugh, it's slimy and goopy. You can't have it. It's mine. Oh, really? So the head doesn't want to give it up. Let's talk to him. Okay, we're here. Now, what do you want from me? Hello, head. <laughs> Hello. Thank you for leading me to the ghost ship. Hey, no problem. When you only have one job, you do it well. Know what I mean? <laughs> May I please have that necklace? No, but thanks for asking so politely. <laughs> Why can't I have it? I've got a bad feeling about this place. I think I might need it. Oh, come on, please. You can beg all you want, but you can't have it. No, but I need it to beat this adventure game. Pretty please? You can beg all you want, but you can't have it. Pretty, pretty please? <laughs> 
You can beg all you want, but you can't have it. Pretty please with sugar on top? <laughs> oh, all right, you big baby. You can have it. Hey, what good's a necklace if you don't have shoulders? <laughs> That's true. Hehehe. <laughs> He's still creepy as all get out, though. This feels weird. Well, now we're invisible to ghosts, so we can actually explore the ghost ship now. Yeah! Yeah. <laughs> I like the effect they have on Guybrush now. What was that? Maybe it was a ghost. <laughs> All right, well that's not gonna work. It looks sound asleep. Can I pick up the? I can't pick that up. He's holding. No, I can't. Oh, here we I go. I can't get it away from him. Well, I just have to wait for him to change position. <laughs> Grog. How do ghosts even drink if they don't have any physical forms? I can't get it away from him. Oh, really? Do we have something we could replace? Maybe not. I'm right, fine. Guess we'll just walk to the passage then. Ghost chickens. They look like chickens. All I got was a feather. Oh well, ghost feather, that could come in handy. They look like chickens. Gross, look at the meat. <laughs> Yeah, you can watch the pig's digestive tracts, and who doesn't want that? I don't see anything special about it. It's a glowing crate. Well, Come on. Big glowing voodoo ante root inside. Aha, uh -huh, that's what I thought. It's locked. It's locked tight. Must be something important down there. Let's I can't it. move it. Oh, really? Do we have a key of some kind? No, we don't. Oh, man. Well, we got a ghost feather, so that'd be useful. Use the feather on his feet. I can't get it away from him. I can't find a ticklish spot on his body. What about his feet? Come on, Guybrush. I can't find a ticklish spot on his body. I guess we gotta be really quick about this. There we go. Boom. It's a bottle of ghost grog. Nice. It's like regular grog, but even grosser. Because ghosts don't have taste buds. A ghost dog. I don't want the bone inside of him. Okay, maybe not. They didn't notice that door opening, even though that's the one they're facing. Okay. Hey! Ah, what be that noise? Hmm, huh, must be the wind. The wind makes not such a creaking. Strange places, strange noises. Okay, so he will actually hear me. Well... That key's probably magnetic. Come on. And we do have a magnetic compass. <laughs> yes. They're having such a grand time. Good for them. That guy's also having a grand old time. All right, we've definitely got the key to that hatch. Open up, Gabra Shreepwood, mighty ghost, coming through. 
Ghost rats. Oh boy. I'm not gonna pick that up. It's covered with rat slobber. I can't pick yeah. that up. Yikes! They hate rats. Oh really? Uh well. If only we still had the gopher repellent. It's called how to arm yourself in sea battle. Aha, ghost grog. Ooh, it's a vat of cooking grease. Ugh, it's all over my hands. But it was for a good cause, Guybrush. I'm sure grease will come in handy somehow. Maybe we can sm throw it in LeChuck's face. Also, yeah, I have not seen the governor around. Okay, the door squeaks. That's why it's not letting us uh, enter and they catch us. It's all over my hands. Well, let's use the, uh, the grease on it. Yeah, now it's silent to open. Ooh, ghost tools. Yes, please. Oh, good. More inventory. <laughs> I don't want to wake him up unless I have some of that anti-ghost potion to defend myself with. Yeah, that's probably true. Alright. Going crate. Why not say anything special about it? Well, except that big glowing voodoo anti root inside. Let's I open. can't get inside it. It's nailed, chained, bolted, roped, glued, and welded together. Oh, how horribly inconvenient. Well, I guess you could say we have the tools for the job. <laughs> this should do it. <laughs> nice. I can't pick that up. I'll just grab this old root and be on my way. It's twisted and dried up and not very impressive looking. Maybe not, but that's exactly what we need. Alright. Well, we have the root, so we've got to take it back to the Monkey Island Cannibals, because they're like, oh, we can make the potion with it. Isn't that ironic? Cannibals that generally eat a only meat. A long meat. walk, a brief oh. row, and a short hike later. Thank you for just warping me back there. I did it! I got the root! Wow! Look! He's not kidding! <laughs> Here it is! He's not such a wimp after all! Come on, let's go make the brew of the fermented root. Wait here, we'll be right back. Yeah! Ghost potion. Oh hey, it's the free-headed monkey! Nice monkey, I got the root. I'm not such a whip after all. <laughs> I'd love to have you stuck. I'd make a fortune. One squirt of that stuff and the ectoplasm really hits the fan. And if you have any left over, it's delicious with a little vanilla ice cream. Good luck! <laughs> Thanks! <laughs> yeah, the potion, the ghost potion of the fermented root that, dis that it exercises spirits, it's root beer. Get it? <laughs> After some more furious paddling... Oh, hey, dude. You scared me half to death! You are dead. <laughs> Balmy weather we're having, isn't it? <laughs> it's always like that down here. I actually like this guy, so I don't really want to kill him. Would you please stop doing that with your head? Sure. <laughs> what happened to the ship? They all left for the wedding. Why are you still here? My head fell into the lava there, and I had to chase after it. And when I came back, they had gone. Oh, poor guy. Shame, too. I hate to miss the wedding. What wedding? LeChuck is marrying the governor of Melee Island. Oh, yeah, right. What? That ain't happening. But how will they... 
Where's the wedding? There's a lovely church on Melee Island. Oh yeah! They're headed there. I pointed that out myself. Melee Island? I knew the church oh, would no. be important. <laughs> I give up. I'm tired of chasing them everywhere. <laughs> what? You can't give up now. What kind of a hero are you anyway? You're right. <laughs> I've got to stop that wedding. <laughs> Bye. Oh hey. My oh, crew there you are. finally got off the ship. We've been looking all over for you. Bob! Hi, Bob. Hi, guys. <laughs> Wait, really? what? See, Bob, you're looking a little pale. Well, naturally, I'm pale. I am dead, <laughs> after all. <laughs> dead? How did that happen? Oh, the usual way. Out for a day's plunder. Ghost ship shows up. The Chuck kills everybody on the crew, and then signs us up on his ship. You know. Gee, that's too bad. Maybe you'd like to join us on our quest for the perfect tan. <laughs> that is well, not what our quest be nice, is about. But I am trying to catch a ride to a wedding on Melee Island. We were about to head back there anyway. How did you get in here without using the head? <laughs> what? Well, well, I mean. That is, you don't seem to have a head, and... <laughs> what? <laughs> um, never mind. You guys know this shambling see-through shade? The one with the slippery grip on his head? You've got to get over this obsession with heads, Threepwood. <laughs> We've got to get back to Melee Island. Oh man, no, no the plot kidding. holes aren't getting hit filled. Yeah, we're out of sunscreen. Are Come you on, kidding me? <laughs> See you, Bob. Bob's coming with us, though, right? Last part, Guybrush kicks butt. Oh, yeah, this is gonna be great. <laughs> well, that certainly was easier than the trip to Monkey Island. <laughs> oh. I wish those guys hadn't been so excited about getting sunscreen. Yikes. Wait a second! <laughs> so this fine, fine mouth. I'm selling this fine mouthwash. <laughs> Is it mint flavored? I only like the minty kind. <laughs> cool. Yes. <laughs> hey, dude. It's the Grim Spectre. Excuse me. Do you have an invitation to the wedding? Yes, I do. No, I'm a gatecrasher. No, but I do have this deadly magic root beer. I must have left it in my... I must have left it in my other pants. <laughs> Bye now. Not so fast, buddy. You don't look very ghost-like to me. You're very pink. Um... <laughs> I suffer from a rare pigmentation efficiency syndrome. It's a sunburn. Sound much like a ghost either. Could you wail and moan or rattle some chains or something? <laughs> My chains are at the cleaners being degreased. My chains are at the cleaners being degreased. <laughs> yes. Well, okay. But where's that dank, musty, beyond the grave ghostly smell? <laughs> it's a new root beer cologne. Perhaps you'd like to try it. Great! Watch out, oh. LeChuck! Yes! There's a new sheriff in town and his name... Hey, I better get to the church. It's his name's not Sheriff Shinetop. Oh, hang on, we gotta visit the voodoo lady. I've got to get to the church! Oh, but, but, but the voodoo lady! Oh well. Hey, shopkeeper. That's not the uh, church! Oh, actually, wait. My, I'm, it must be time for my looting at this point. That's not the way to the church. But, but you can loot the governor's manor first before saving the governor. If there be any man with reason, that leads to uh, 
people should not be united in blissful matrimony. Let him speak now, or forever hold his peace. Oh man, the groom isn't a gentleman, the groom isn't a human. Oh wait, stop the wedding! <laughs> hey, who's that? You! <laughs> I just remembered an appointment at the dentist. <laughs> I've just remembered an appointment at the dentist. <laughs> You'll need one when I'm through with you. Governor! <laughs> Governor! Governor? What's going on? Oh, Guybrush, you mad fool! I'm impressed you came to rescue me, but it really wasn't necessary. Oh, really? I had everything well in hand. Unfortunately, yeah, feminism. the Bible has made it necessary for me to tip my hand early. <laughs> how? Who? But how did you manage to escape? <laughs> oh, that was easy. Lechucky's a bozo. Hey! <laughs> and lots of his crew members were friends of mine, when they were alive. <laughs> if you're here, then who's that in the dress? What? Of course. Can we don't scare them? They have my ghost sapping root beer bottle. Oh, I'll get it. <laughs> oh, great. Oops. <laughs> oh, nice going, guy brush. Now I've got to chase them down to get my voodoo root beer back. But I've got voodoo I... root beer. Well, uh, hey. You dared come here and confront me? I can't believe your audacity! <laughs> I just remembered an appointment at the dentist. Well, I can't believe your stupidity. <laughs> yeah? Well, I can't believe your frivolity. <laughs> well, I can't believe your enormity. Yeah? Well, I can't believe your mobility. <laughs> well, I can't believe your atrocity. Yeah? Well, I can't believe your fragility. Well, I can't believe your alacrity. <laughs> ah, I grow tired of you. Oh no, but I had more! Um, say now, let's not be hasty. <laughs> Whoa! Apparently ghosts are solid. Whoa! My root beer bottle! That's not good! I love the chunk scene though. I thought the last chapter was Guybrush kicks butt, not what Chuck kicks Guybrush's butt. Whoa! No, not the stands, not the stands! Oh no. <laughs> Ouch. That's gotta really hurt. Good to see you, son. How's oh, the no. ship? Oh no. If you're no. interested in trading up, I can give you a fair prize for it. No way, my ship's amazing. Howdy, partner. You know, just by looking at you, I can tell <laughs> you're a man of the world. A man with an eye for quality. A man who knows a good bargain when he... <laughs> Thank you, Chuck. <laughs> Let's see, uh, one dollar B8. I want one guy brush free one. <laughs> Ouch. That's really gotta hurt. No! <laughs> How is Gapper still alive? I'll... That doesn't seem to work. I'll give you money if you don't punch me again. Would <laughs> Chuck for Smash Bros. Or Guybrush for Smash Bros. Both would be a good choice. Man, I don't know about you, Chuck, but all of this getting punched business is me 
thirsty. I want to get a drink. But... Oh, but, but I, I'm thirsty for some grog. Maybe I was playing in the wrong slot. It, uh, in the grog. <laughs> no, in the grog machine. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> Captain Smirk, <laughs> help me. <laughs> Doggone it. Oh, hey, root beer. Hey, uh, Machuck. <laughs> yeah, any old root beer would work. Instant replay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, this game. That was worth seeing twice, let's be honest. I wish we could see Stan getting punched in the face twice. <laughs> Blimp map. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> it's like Disney World. <laughs> with the fireworks, not with people's heads exploding. Hey, Elaine! Yikes! <laughs> oh, don't sneak up on me like that. Sorry. I got punched eight times today That's already. Okay. <laughs> you know, LeChuck was a deviant, obnoxious, slithery, creepy, crawly sort of a guy, but I'll say one thing for him. What's that? He sure looks nice exploding against the night sky. <laughs> yes, it's very romantic. <laughs> Can I buy you a root beer? <laughs> Actually, I'm a bit sick of it. Sure. There's more at Stan's. Oh gosh, I hope Stan's okay. I don't, really. <laughs> you know, I completely forgot about Herman Toothrot. Uh-oh. Now I wonder where my pirate friend has got to. I certainly hope he didn't leave without me. Whoops. <laughs> Sorry, Toothrot. <laughs> At least you got your banana picker back. Yeah, at least I learned something from all this. What's that? Never pay more than 20 bucks for a computer game. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Not sure why I said that. <laughs> and that's the secret of Monkey Island. <laughs> Yes! That game is unbelievably hilarious. <laughs> Internally developed by... These people. And for those of you who are wondering, this has many games in this series. So the next one is Monkey Island 2, but Chuck's Revenge. Then Curse of Monkey Island, which only recently came out on Steam. Then there's also Escape from Monkey Island and Tales of Monkey Island. I have not played Curse of Monkey Island, and I also have not beaten Escape from Monkey Island, but I can tell you that... The games that I have played are all very funny and very well done. I will... Well, I might eventually do Monkey Island 2. That one, I'd say, is a little better than Monkey Island 1, at least in terms of controls. But if I do, it'll be... It's going to be a while before I actually end up doing that. So, sit back, relax, and enjoy these fabulous credits. Matt Aldrich was the art director. Thank you for that. Julian Gerard Batoz, Sophie Karamagiz, I don't know, I'm so sorry if I'm butchering these people's names. Aaron Brown, I know that one. <laughs> Mike Olmos. <laughs> and speaking of the trumpet, how about that trumpet in the background? I just realized that Chuck's theme is basically a darker, cooler version of Cruz's theme from Skyward Sword. <laughs> Meat Hook and his tattoo. 
Wait, Red Skull the Cannibal was Otis, not Stan? Really? Interesting. <laughs> Lemon Head was also the sc Scumbar Pirate, Mystery Pirate 1, and Sword Fight Opponent 2. Interesting. Bum, 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 bum. But yeah, if you like this game, I would get the second one and play it for yourself. It's very well done, even if there are several puzzles that are just like, really? How would you ever figure that out? But yeah, I had a lot of fun playing this game. I hope you guys had a lot of fun watching it. Even if my commentary wasn't great, I figured that this game was funny enough that that could essentially carry the Let's Play itself, even if I didn't say anything. But I do hope that you enjoyed my commentary a little bit I gave, and thank you for watching the series. If you watched it all the way through, if you liked what you saw, then you can subscribe to my channel if you wanted, and it'll let you know when I make new videos. Not required it by any means. This is not my job. I doubt this will ever be my job. I don't really want to monetize any of my videos. So I really just do this for fun for myself, and if other people happen to like that, then that's awesome too. Yeah, I'm not sure what I'll do for my next Let's Play. If I might do a short Let's Play. Like, I might do another short point-and-click game as a Let's Play. I might do something a bit more substantial. We'll have to wait and see, and we'll also have to, I'll also have to check to see if my uh, GameCube controller adapter is here before I left that back at home. Well, one way or another, that'll probably determine what my next Let's Play will be. So, there's that. <laughs> Man, there are a lot more credits than I remember. Then again, there was also the original people who made this original game, and then the people who worked on making the HD re-release. Because the original game had 8-bit graphics, 8-bit music, and also did not have voice talent, as you would imagine. So they had to do a lot of work making this. Special thanks to all these people and all the fans worldwide. That includes me! Well, thank you for thanking me. For thanking you for making these this amazing game. This game's on Steam, by the way. Good bargain. Very special thanks to Rod Gilbert. I don't know who that is, but apparently he did. Oh, very, very special thanks to George Lucas, obviously. Great guy. This software is based in part on the work of the independent JPEG group. For the purpose of this copyright and license, contributing to our offers is defined as the following set of individuals. <laughs> PNG reference library is supplied as is. <laughs> you know, I'm surprised we haven't seen an anti-piracy message yet. <laughs> oh, that was that was a terrible way to end the Let's Play, but I also can't think of anything more appropriate as regarding who I am as a person. So, <laughs> thanks again for watching. I hope to see you for my next Let's Play. Guybrush Shreepwood will return. So, will Colorful Artie in a future Let's Play. Hope to see you then. Until we meet again, have a great day, and God bless. Yo ho, yo ho, a pirate's like Boogie. We pillage, we plunder, we rifle, and look, drink up, we hearty, yo ho. We kidnap and drive and don't give a hungry.